Democratic candidates in the South Bend mayor's race are reacting to the news of Clay High School closing down. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Lauren Moss. And I'm Terry McFadden. The South Bend School Board approved the facilities master plan on Monday and it means Clay High School and Warren Elementary will both be shut down in late 2024. And Marie Catanz writes outside Clay High School with how Henry Davis Jr. and Mayor James Mueller are feeling about the school board's vote. Marie, what can you tell us? Yeah, Councilman Henry Davis Jr. Lauren and Terry says he's not buying the idea that the school district has to right size words that they've used, right size the school corporation, therefore having to close Clay High School, which has seen a decrease in enrollment over the last decade. While Mayor James Mueller says he understands that the school board had to make a difficult decision given the circumstances that they're facing. On a sunny spring day, Henry Davis Jr. feeling a sense of gloom about Clay High School closing. Monday was a, uh, a really, really day to actually grieve the city of South Bend. The Democratic mayoral challenger expressing several concerns at a Wednesday news conference. We continue to operate independently. We'll be just right sides until we don't have anything left. Davis saying that he believes Mayor Mueller and the school corporation did not communicate enough on a major decision. Our children need space. They don't need to be pushed into one building. Our, our children need an opportunity to grow here. They need the opportunity to be on sports teams, debate teams, etc. When we close schools, we lessen those opportunities. On Wednesday, Mayor Mueller's office noting in a news release that while the district and city government are separate entities under state law, last September, Davis was the only council member to vote against a joint resolution between the Common Council and school board to expand their partnership. In a statement, Mayor Mueller says in part, our state's policies have undermined and underfunded urban public school systems across the state and have forced tough decisions on South Bend schools. I appreciate the school board's efforts to make the best of a difficult situation, reestablishing neighborhood schools, expanding early childhood education, and creating more technical career training opportunities. And I reached out to Republican mayoral candidate for South Bend, Desmond Upchurch, but he was out of town. All right, Maria Catanzaro reporting live tonight from Clay Township. Maria, thank you.